Hey, I'm here with this indoor grill that I just got from Amazon. Just took it out the box, directions. Um, before I start, let me just say that the on the inside of the cooking service, it looks like it's about 13 and a quarter inches by just under eight. The unit itself is about nine by, I already measured it, nine by about 19-ish inches. The grilling surface, heating element, looks like we've got a cord and a drip tray. So we're going to use this in a minute, so I'm going to pause the video and use it and let you guys know what we think. Okay, not quite ready to start this just yet, but I just watched this so we can start it off and want you to see these, the heating element here, and it runs alongside these grooves. So one nice thing is that when you put this in here, the heating element fits inside of here. So as you're cooking and you have grease that drips, Notice it'll never touch the heating element. It'll fall into the um, drip pan below, right there. Another thing I like is that this seems to be really, um, the surface here seems to have a really nice, slick, non-stick surface. I just washed this, and if you notice, it is perfectly dry. All I did was bang it once, and any water that was here came, it just slid right off. The bottom I had to dry with a paper towel, and I don't know how well you can see it. There's still some water, not easy getting a towel in there, but um, we're going to start. And I'm going to pause the video and let you, guys, let you guys know what we think. Okay, we just put on some sweet Italian sausages. Um, I don't know if you can hear the grill going. Um, it tells you the drip tray needs to have water in it. So if you notice, whoop, can't take it out now, kind of hot. The drip tray is has water, so I guess when the grease goes through those little holes over here, that the, um, the grease won't be falling directly into the drip tray. It'll be falling into water. So it's been going on for about a minute. Going to pause the video until it's time to turn these things over. It's been about three, four minutes. Um, by the way, this thing has a few settings. It goes to minimum, then one, two, three, four, five, then maximum. We've got it on four right now. So you can think four out of six. And this thing seems to be doing a decent job. No smoke or anything, it's just basically a uh, grill that gets hot using um, coils below that literally turn red, you know, just as expected. So anyway, this seems to work. No issues at all. Um, hope this helps someone. Um, can't wait till these things are done. Take care, everyone.